Hey everybody, it's Erin Reed and welcome to my channel, Erin Reed Makes. Today I want to show you some amazing new fun stuff I just got in from Diamond Art by Leisure Arts. These are their diamond painting kits. They are so cool. Or paint by number, diamond paint by number, even better. They are all set for the holidays, so for Christmas. So I picked up the Christmas tree, the beautiful lantern, and then this gorgeous reindeer. Look how gorgeous this is. Let's open up the Christmas tree and I'll show you how it works. So first of all, you start off, you have a whole bunch of little packets of your gems. These ones are rounded dome gems. They are so cool. And every single one of them has a number on them. So you can see it has a code and a number. And then you also get a baggie of your tray, of which if you have lots of these kits or you've done more than one, save your trays because it's kind of handy having more than one tray with different colors. You also get extra baggies. And this is for when you have leftover bits. Now let me show you what I do with mine. So I take all of my leftover bits, including my trays and stuff, and I keep them in here and I use them for future projects, little fun stuff if I ever want little gems. So this is where you can save all of your extra fun little gem pieces. And you can also save your tool. So, so in your bag, you also get a tool, a little kind of a foam piece to put on your tool, and then you get the little sticky stuff because that's how you're able to pick up the gems. And then you have your image. Now, this is one of the more complicated ones, which means the entire background is one where you're gonna cover with diamonds, meaning that every single space in here is covered. So since you have to cover the entire backside with gems, this takes a little bit of time, but let me tell you, it is so much fun. So you peel off the plastic cover. This side is sticky. So what you do is you take your stylus, you pick it up, and you place it down. Now I'm gonna show you some older ones that I have done that are not Christmas, but just to show you what they look like when they're finished. So if Christmas is not your speed, here are some other fun ones. So this is one where not the entire piece is covered. It's just a little intermediate piece. This is a little Unikitty, super cute. We also have one which is a dragon eye. This one is so cool. And this one is one where the entire space is covered, which is really, really cool. And then we also have done one which is a unicorn. I love this one, it is so, so pretty. It is just really cool. Again, it's just the unicorn, the surrounding bits are not. And then what can you do with all these fun things? Well, you can cut them out and obviously frame them. You can put them on book bags. You can put them on pillows. You can put them all different kinds of binder covers, journal covers, have a blast with what you wanna use them for. So if you are looking for a fun, fun Christmas gift or Christmas activity that you can do, the entire family, my daughter who's seven, all the way up to myself, including my 13-year-old son and my nine-year-old son, all get into doing this. We put it on a table, leave it going for a while. We did that with some of the ones that were not holiday over our summer vacation, and everybody just kind of sat down and played and decorated, and it was really, really fun. So it's like an alternative to a puzzle. It's an alternative to a cross-stitch. It's an alternative to like a paint by number. It's kind of a blend of all of that together and they really are fun. So links for where you can find all these are going to be down below. This is just a small sampling of the Christmas ones that are available. There are others that are also Christmassy themed and then there is a ton that are not Christmas. They are just general and all of those links will be down below for you. So thanks so much. Please subscribe and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye bye everybody.